Hi, I'm uh, Representative Mitch Belinsky. I, uh, I represent Newtown and uh, Sandy Hook and have for 12 years. I've also been on the Aging Committee for 10. Um, the Aging Committee has always been a committee that's been very bipartisan, uh, but it hasn't had the horsepower to actually pass very hard, very meaningful policy until recently, in the, you know, pretty much since the pandemic. Um, it's, it's a it's an honor to be involved in policy like what we are putting forth today. Um, the word that my friend Jane was, was searching for is transformative. Thank you. <laughs> um, and that word cannot be used strongly enough when it comes to this piece of legislation because, um, because what it's going to do is change the entire dynamic of how people age. And we've been talking about aging in place for as long as I've been here, but now we're actually going to be able to um, not just talk the talk, but walk the walk with it. And it's, uh, it's a significant, significant game changer for an awful lot of people. Does anybody in this room, show of hands, this is the, not, a, not something we usually do at a press conference, show of hands though. Anybody here had a loved one that has been uh, emergency admitted to a, uh, a skilled nursing facility because they got sick in a big hurry they were discharged uh, from a hospital setting and there was no place else for them to go than into a nursing home. Show of hands. Okay, well, <laughs> well I've, had it happen, yeah. <laughs> I've had it happen twice. So, mm -hmm. um, in the past we haven't had the choice. Families, when they're faced with a loved one that, um, you know, that has a, a, a setback, um, that setback can become permanent if the discharge is handled to a nursing home facility where somebody's out of place, not in their element, not with their family, and not amongst those that love them and make them most comfortable. Um, the transformative part of this is that now we're going to be able to help in in-home placements, assisted technology, we're going to be able to assess needs and have certified people that can come to somebody's house to provide the care that they get in an assisted living facility, but they get to do that at home. And that's the place people are most comfortable and that's where the outcomes will always be the best. So um, what we're doing is we're enabling the 75% of the people that want to age in place in the state of Connecticut to actually age in place as a first choice rather than having to default to the institutional choice of a nursing home. Um, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is the reason this is a bipartisan issue. Mm -hmm. um, this, this is a societally important stake in the ground. And it's policy I feel so incredibly strongly about that um, Regardless of the little bumps in the road, we must, must have this policy. It is absolutely in tune with where America is going and Connecticut gets to be a leader.